Now for this next question then, we've got to work out what E of T is, the expected value of our random variable T. And we should know that this is to work out the sum of all our observed values multiplied by their corresponding probabilities. So it would be T times the probability that T equals that particular value of T. In other words, we've just got to do naught that t value times 7 sixteenths we're doing the sum of sigma so sum of 1 times 1 sixteenth and we've just got to keep that going 2 times the 1 eighth plus 3 times the 1 eighth plus 4 times the 1 sixteenth whoops okay 4 times the 1 sixteenth 6 times the 1 eighth tedious I know plus 9 times the 1 16th and what's it going to be okay well if you work that out you'll find that you get 36 over 16 or you could leave that as an exact decimal 2.25 all right